Today's topic is non-homogeneous differential equation and this is from the differential equations of first order and first degree and here is the question x plus y minus 1 into dy by dx is equal to x minus y plus 2. So we can write this in the form of dy by dx is equal to x minus y plus 2 divided by this is x plus y minus 1. So there are two methods in this homogeneous differential equation. Here the quotient of x is equal to 1. See here the quotient of x is 1 and here the quotient of y is minus 1. And if you observe the quotient of x is 1 and again the quotient of y is 1. So if you make AD minus BC, if A, B, C, D, if you make AB minus AC, that is 1 into 1 minus of minus plus this is 1 into minus 1. So this will be, see here, AD 1 into 1 and this is minus of, this is 1 into minus 1. So this will be 1 plus 1 which is equal to 2 and this is not equal to 0. If it's not equal to 0, so how we have to solve this? So we have to take a small substitution here as small x is equal to capital X plus H and small y is equal to capital Y plus K. So what is the derivative of this? Small dx is equal to capital DX where H is a constant and small dy is equal to the derivative is capital DY. So I will transform this equation into see here. This will be changed as in place of small dy I am writing capital DY. So this is capital DY and in place of small dx I am writing capital DX is equal to in place of x I have to write x plus h. So this is x plus h minus in place of y I am keeping y plus k. This is y plus k plus 2 divided by see here in place of x it is x plus h plus in place of y this is y plus k this is minus 1. Now see here this is dy by dx is equal to this is x plus h minus y minus k plus 2 and here this is x plus h plus y plus k minus 1. So now it can be written as dy by dx is equal to this is x minus y plus and this is this can be written as these are all the constants here that is h this is h this is minus k and this is plus 2 and next one here is the variables are x plus y. So this is x and this is y. This is x plus y plus and this can be written as h plus k and this is minus 1. And now I will take only this part homogeneous part that is dy by dx is equal to dy by dx is equal to x minus y by x plus y. Here throughout the equation it is maintaining the same degree degree 1. So it is a homogeneous differential equation. So as it is a homogeneous differential equation, so there is a substitution. What is the substitution here? Put y is equal to vx. If I derive on both sides with respect to x, then dy by dx will be for x it is 1 and x if I leave it will be dv by dx. Now this equation will turn into, so if it is equation 1, so equation 1 becomes See here, in place of dy by dx, I am writing as v plus x into this is dv by dx is equal to x as it is. In place of y, I am writing vx minus this is vx by x in place of y, I am writing this is vx. So later, I have to take x as common and cancel. So in order to take x as common and cancel, see what happens here. This is v plus x into this is dv by dx. If I take x common, this will be 1 minus v. And if I take x common, this will be 1 plus v. Now, I can cancel this. I can cancel this x. After cancelling this x, I will send this cap, uh, plus v to other side and it will become minus. That is x into dv by dx will be, see here, this will be, 1 minus v by this is 1 plus v minus v 
and if I take LCM that is x into dv by dx is equal to if I take 1 plus v as LCM this is 1 minus v minus v times of 1 plus v and this is x into dv by dx is equal to this is 1 minus v if I multiply this is minus v and this is minus v square it is 1 plus v that is x into dv by dx is equal to 1 minus 2v minus v square by 1 plus v so now i have to use variables and separables method so if i separate the variables and separables method variables and separables method if i choose then I have to separate v to one side and x to another side. If I send v to one side, it will be 1 plus v by. So, if I send this to other side, this will be v square plus 2v minus 1. So, if I take minus common here and this will be minus dx by x. Now, if I integrate on both sides, see what happens. If I integrate on both sides, so for v square, there should be 2v and for 2v, for v it is 1, there should be 2. So, in that case, so I will multiply with the 2 and divide with 2. And this is 2 plus and this is 2 times of. So, this is 2 times of v. So, I am multiplying with 2 and dividing with 2. This is v square plus 2v minus 1 is equal to minus dx by x. See here the derivative of v square is 2v here and for 2v, for v it is 1, 2 is there. So it will be half times of log of this is v square plus 2v minus 1 is equal to minus log x plus log c. So if I bring this minus log to other side, this will be half times of log of v square plus 2v minus 1 plus log x is equal to some log c. If I take 2 as LCM, so this is log of, this is v square plus 2v minus 1 plus 2 log x is equal to log c. And see here, this can be written as log of, this is v square plus 2v minus 1 plus log x square is equal to log c. Log a plus log b is nothing but log a into b this is v square plus 2v minus 1 into x square is equal to log c now i can cancel log on both sides if i cancel log on both sides what remains here so this will be v square plus 2v minus 1 into x square is equal to c and you know that there is a substitution that so here i have substituted as a y is equal to vx so y is equal to vx so the same here y is equal to vx so v will be this is y by x so now i'll substitute in place of v i'll substitute y by x so this is y by x whole square plus 2 times of this is y by x minus 1 into x square is equal to c so if i take if i square that is x square y square by x square plus 2y by x minus 1 into x square is equal to c. So, if I take x square as LCM, this is y square plus 2xy minus x square into x square is equal to c. Now, I can cancel this x square. So, if I cancel this x square, what remains y square plus 2xy minus x square is equal to c. And here, let me show you. So, here... I kept like this h minus k plus 2 is equal to 0. So h minus k plus 2 is equal to 0 is one equation and h plus k minus 1 h plus k minus 1 is equal to 0. That is h plus k minus 1 is equal to 0. If I solve these, if I solve these two equations then see what remains here. So this is minus 1 2 1 minus 1 and this is 1 minus 1 1 and again 1. So, what is our h value? So, h value will be 1 minus 2 and k value will be 2 plus 1 and 1 is equal to 1 plus 1. So, h by minus 1, k by 3 is equal to 1 by 2 and h value is minus half and k value is 3 by 2. So, I got my h value as well as k value and there is a substitution here for this case. For this case and the here the substitution is nothing but small x is equal to capital X plus H and small x is equal to capital X plus H and small y is equal to capital Y plus K. So in this 
So the solution is in the capital letters and I have to transform it into small letters. So small x is equal to capital X. H is nothing but minus half. So this is minus half. Y is equal to this is Y plus this is 3 by 2. And now capital X value is equal to small x plus half and capital Y value is Y minus 3 by 2. This is Y minus 3 by 2. And we got all the values as x as well as this y. So now I will substitute in this equation and that will be the final answer. In place of capital Y, I am writing that is y minus 3 by 2 whole square plus 2 times of what is our x value? x is nothing but this is x plus half. And this y value is nothing but y minus 3 by 2 minus what is our x value so x plus half whole square is equal to c so this is the final general solution so this is the general solution of the equation one so let me explain you once again so the question is of the form so here is the question it was given like this and uh, it's very easy to rem uh, remember that if there are numerals at the last then we have to find that it is a non-homogeneous differential equation so in most cases the numerals will be there one two or like that so dy by dx is equal to x minus y plus two and x plus y minus one so these numerals will be there and we have to identify that it is of a non-homogeneous method and there are two types non-homogeneous method is of two types first of all we have to find out if it's equal to zero it's another model and if it's not equal to zero this model so this is the quotient of one uh, x1 this is a1 this is b1 and a2 this is b2 a1 a2 minus b1 b2 so this is a1 b1 a2 b2 see here this is a1 this is b1 this is a2 and this is b2 if i multiply a1 b2 minus a2 b1 which is not equal to zero if it's not equal to zero here is the substitution that small x is equal to x plus h and small y is equal to y plus k if i substitute and uh, now we got a homogeneous differential equation again same process put y is equal to vx and dy by dx is equal to v plus x into dv by dx and after transforming into variables and separables method and integrating on both sides we got the final answer and after getting the final answer we have to transform this again into the small letters so here is the substitution and i got after solving i got h value as minus half and k value as 3 by 2 and the capital letter x can be replaced by small x plus half and capital y can be replaced as small y minus 3 by 2 and in this solution so this is the final solution and in this so this is in the capital letters and if i transform into the question form so this is in place of y i have to write as y minus 3 by 2 whole square in place of y and again in place of x i have to write as x plus half and in place of y that again y minus 3 by 2 whole square and this is the general solution and this is how we have to solve i'll be posting many more videos in this series and please have a look at those and if you really like you know please take time to raise your thumb share it with your friends and before you leave you know what to do please subscribe